man, here we go. Second video. We are reacted to 2023 XXL Freshman Cypher versus ranked from worst to best. Bro got 53 subscribers. Y'all go support this goddamn channel. You can easily look this video up. Um, it popped up in my recommended. This is personal opinion, but let's see if I agree with it. Let's see. Always hate, ain't trying to get no loot. I can't lie, that bitch can't cut his way. Finesse well, two times gotta, gotta be number one. Cute. I wake up every day and chase that pay that son you should do. Yo, it's WM, and the 2023 XXL Freshman Cyphers dropped, and there were two Cyphers instead of the usual three Cyphers, including a six-person Cypher, which I'm not sure if they've ever done before. And in yeah. my opinion, one Cypher was decent, and the other was not very good. Yeah. In this video, I'm going to be ranking the 10 Cypher verses from worst to best. Cause my eyes twitching, that means there's somebody <laughs> Seven, six, twos, they like five. Listen, listen. Two Rare was doing good in the middle? In the beginning, I was like, eh? In the middle, he was doing straight. But once he started shaking his hips, listen. I've listened to some songs from this guy, and they weren't good. His XXL freestyle was trash, and this is also damn, trash. Damn. When I saw there was two minutes left in the video when he started rapping and everyone else had already gone, I was already unhappy. And for the most part, his flow was terrible, and he sounded off-key. But I did like his dancing at the end. So for that, it goes from a 1 out of 10 to a 2 out of 10 for me. It's kind of different for me. I fuck. I fucked with his flow. His flow was like it was cool in the beginning. It was, it wasn't all that. But when he got to the middle, it was decent. I was sitting on that bench. They wouldn't play me. Now I'm up on niggas like I'm KD. Hey, now I just shoot, shoot. Hey. When I saw Fraud, it was on the freshman list. I was wondering how it would fit on the cipher since he's a singer. YK Osiris was terrible on his cypher in 2019, but another singer, August Alcina, did well on his YK, YK Osiris? He made double A sales since? What the fuck? Cypher in 2014. Friday, however, did not fit the Pierre Bourne beat at all. It was just offbeat singing. He is a good singer, though. I liked his freestyle and his hook on the song Forever by Lil Baby. He just didn't fit on here. Facts. I feel like he should have did what someone like Gunna or Baby Keem or Trippy Red did and just not done the XXL cypher since he didn't really fit on it. I would have respected it if Friday would have sat out of the cypher. I would have definitely respected that. My problems in the blunt, I'ma spark them L's. Send shots to your man's while he pick up the shells. Uh, you know I gotta keep it discreet. Don't wanna hear no feedback when I'm feeding the streets. Uh. From the music I've heard, I think Lola Brooke is a decent rapper, but on here she was offbeat and just said a bunch of nothing. Don't really have much to say about this verse. You know I've been having shit, I ain't never been no fucker on her. Little bitch bad is making good, but Boston probably still won't fuck her. She know I'm different. No switches with me. Boston Richie Richie was straight to me. Now, unlike Lola and Friday, real boss and Richie had a decent flow on this beat. Yep. The problem is, he had this weird bar where he said he was trying to fuck his cousin. Bro, I didn't peep that shit. I meant to say that in the last Double XL video I reacted to about that bar. I didn't peep it at first. I thought he said some other shit. So that disqualifies him from doing yeah, anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that puts you lower on the mean. list, buddy. Not going. You ain't on that ground no more. You ain't going hell no more. Uh. I guess niggas going broke. Just like that, you got exposed. Uh. I've been in Miami on a boat, fucking the baddest yeah. hoes. This was just a decent verse. Nothing special on his bars were average, but his flow was cool. I don't took a lot of niggas bitches. That's why they don't like me. Put up to the jeweler, drop that bag until that nigga ice me. I've been running through these. No way you gonna put Tia over. Lil Tyler and Rob 49. No way you're about to do that shit. Rats, I swear this shit get like pricey. I said, this is a pain, but damn. Be what? Be my wife. Yeah. Let's see what he got Everything say. that I just said about Rob 49's verse, I could say about Lil Tyler's. It was smooth. I like this verse a bit better than Rob's. I will say that when I saw the trailers for the ciphers they released a few days before the cipher, I thought that this would be another Lil Mosey type verse, but oh. it wasn't. Okay. Like, who the fuck you talk to? Me, you know, just pay me to walk through. You be looking like me because I taught you. Wasn't a big fan of her, her, uh, Freestyle on, I mean, a cypher or the freestyle, really, because it was too short. That's it. I ain't want to get bad, but I got to. She had a good flow. We gonna fight it, this bitch. I got but it was too short. Tia and Real Boston Richie were the only two artists on here that I've never heard of before the XXL stuff, so I really didn't know what to expect. Her verse was the shortest verse of the people in her cypher, but I'd say it was a good verse. A lot of people in the comments section of the video said she was saying a bunch of nothing, which is kind of true, but I did really like her flow on here. Uh, 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 who that is the man? Give the man respect. DC to die. I think I have him at number. I gotta. See, who else is left on the list? Finesse two times and um. Let's see. I forgot. B, I play with them bands. Okay. DC the Don has some songs I like, and his fans were all over the XXL comment section on every post saying he was gonna have a great cipher. 
Who, who else is right. left on the list? There were two others I thought oh, were better, Sleazy. but he was good. I don't do shit without my dog. I feel like Johnny Tess. Yeah. I pay gorillas to rap shit in the hood. I'm Gotti. Yeah. My little nigga trying to strike shit. He look like Lil Yachty. <laughs> Sleazy World Ghost flow sounds the same on pretty much every song he has, and it was a similar flow on here, but I actually really liked it. His flow is repetitive, but I think it's good and it definitely fit this beat. I liked his bars, as he referenced a lot of rappers such as Ice Spice, Lil Yachty, and Lola Brill, and their songs hard. Munch, Strike, and Don't Play With It. Hard. After listening to this verse a couple more times, I thought about maybe putting this at number one, but ultimately I decided I liked another verse better. Listen, Finesse did his thing, The only finesse song I know is his most popular song, Back End, and it's a good song, but after hearing his cypher and freestyle, I feel like I need to hear more music from him. Bro, he wanted, he he wanted it more out of everybody on this list, opinion. bro. His flow also fit the beat perfectly, and while Sleazy's bars were probably better than his, I just enjoyed listening to this verse a bit more. Yeah. So that's my list. If you disagree with me, let me know in the comment section what your ranking would be. Listen, the only thing I disagree with on this list is the fact that you had Tia over... Lil Tyler and Rob 49 with that short ass verse. But other than that, bro, it was a W.